here, Mo Shahab, Mo me, Mo Nink. Which one? You have to. Uh, mm. Mo Said. Oh, okay, that's me. Uh, okay, so I, I want to praise um, um, Tosini for working on Notification Center. I want to praise um, Mio for and Rodri for work, for taking care of the the nice token symbol and and poaps. Don't very nice. And uh, I want to praise um, Mitch for helping with the nice token. I want to praise Monique for uh, keeping iClock clean and uh, praise Marco for reviewing the gift power. Uh, and also Lauren. Uh, yeah, that, that's all. I pass it to Rodri. Hi, everyone. Thanks, Mo. Uh, I want to praise uh, Marco, Mo, uh, Tosini, and Mio for amazing team. Uh, I want to praise all the dev team. I want to praise uh, Lauren, Daniel, Marco for helping me uh, work with me in the Give It Swag. Uh, I want to praise everybody who stayed here. Uh, I passed to, I don't know, Jake? Yep. Thanks. So I'll start by uh, praising Griff and everyone. This has been a really cool journey so far. Everybody's so great. Uh, we'll start there. I want to praise Ahmad for being a great buddy uh, and being available at any time of day, any time of night. Uh, as well as I want to praise Melody for the same reason and helping me with my first real uh, giveth project on donor relations. And I will pass it to Vlad. Hey guys. Uh, well, I want to praise Crusher because uh, he makes like everything happens in the pen and if the scenario is like not favorable on a praise really on a praise the seven moderators because i gotta remember them on a praise grief for representing grief and really again representing uh shape shift and give us uh on the events on a play praise laurie for being always present there and i want to praise uh latin boys of shape shift and Diogo J, it's kind of, uh, it's a new user, a new project that's come up to the sector. And I want to welcome him and praise to everyone here in this call, especially the skateboarders. <laughs> and I pass to... Go for it. I don't know what's pass to Giant, Giant King. Oh no, giant giant kin can't talk. It seems so. Um, I'll I'll just throw it to Casale. Oh no, Casale's muted. How about Chewy? Uh, Chewy, are you around? I think. Uh, can you hear me? Yeah, we hear you now. Oh, perfect. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, thanks, Griff. Um, I'm a little bit distracted, so I just uh. Praise uh, Lauren, Ashley, Danny, Mitch, uh, Monique, Griff, uh, who have uh, engaged with uh, uh, the discussion that I uh, around the proposal that I presented in the forum. Thank you uh, very much uh, for helping out with that. And I also want to praise the Shapeshift Latam team because they are amazing. Uh, I'll pass it. Uh, I'll pass it to Danny. Hello, good morning. Um, I've put a bunch of praise in the channel, but I'll read a few of them off that I feel like haven't been, so I'm not repeating. Praise Abby, Wild Wanderer, Jake, Ahmad, Clara, and Lauren for working with the Giveth Connect and the Giving Block to see how we can integrate better and provide the answers for the nonprofit world. I want to praise Nicola and Ashley for being so diligent in maintaining project verification process. Um, I want to praise Melody and Ashley for the great emails and messaging that they're sending out to project owners. Really encourages and builds rapport. I want to praise Lauren for seeing what needs to be communicated all over the place and then using Twitter as one of our tools for education. And I'll praise Mitch for an austerity forum post that had so many different tracks and ideas in it and then carrying out each of them. And I will pass it to Jay. Yes, sorry, I have a new timer alarm. That was a weird one. 
I cannot find the window again. <laughs> Shit. Um, yeah. Thank you, Dani. I praise Bodhisattva, protector of life. I praise Mitch for his important work in governance, man, you rock. Praise the design team for being so inspired. Uh, praise the developers for being accurate. Praise Moshi Hub for demoing our infrastructure in shiny Kubernetes. And praise Torey for working on also that Kubernetes migration and having a buddy call with me. Praise Freshella and Nick Balls for sending uh, reminders. So I actually go anywhere. Praise uh, Griff and Lauren for representing uh, at events. Very cool to see. Praise Giantkin, uh, our great uh, Discord mod. And um, praise Ahmad for pushing it to external comms. And I want to praise everyone in the Give It Connect initiative. And I have to check back in more with your work. Um, I really lost the window. I cannot see Discord right now. Uh, um, so I don't know who's in the call. <laughs> I, 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 I can pass it for you. Yep, Thanks. Uh, let's, let's throw it to, oh, no, no, Clara. Hi, everyone. How are you all doing? I'd like to praise everybody in the Connect and Comms team this week for um, some really good teamwork, including re outreach to project success stories, um, fundraising, coming donor survey, um, some other partner outreach, and looking to bring new projects on board, um, uh, community building, uh, Melody and Reiner for the EU Consult Outreach this week, and Melody and Jake for their work on the upcoming donor survey. And I'd like to pass it to, goodness, I don't know who's gone actually today. I'm sending it back to you, Griff, sorry. Sure, no problem. How about <laughs> you tomorrow? Hey, Griff, thank you so much. Uh, can you hear me? I hear you great. Okay, awesome. Thank you so much for, I mean, I, I want to praise first you for, I mean, having this kind of uh, a community which was built like a couple of years ago. So I'm a new joinee here. So I want to praise all the people who have helped me to throughout the onboarding process so far. So I want to praise Ahmed. I want to praise Fischel and Nico. Uh, Hida, uh, I want to praise uh, for me, uh, for being a buddy, uh, for me, uh, uh, more Monique. I also want to praise Mo Shahab, who has also been helping me with respect to all the uh, basic terminologies in this uh, uh, in this uh, industry. And also, I praise uh, all the team uh, members that I have met in the last uh, couple of dev calls. Uh, I want to name all of them. So, I mean, uh, uh, Ranjaba, Carlos, Cherik. Ramin, uh, Alizera, Meteo. So they're all really good, and I want to praise all of them, and I want uh, to praise also the, the people who are here doing and serving in some other way to make things better for this community. Thank you. Uh, I want to uh, give it to Rodri, if he has not already done. Yeah, I done. I don't know, Santi? Nice. Thank you. Uh, good morning, everyone. I want to give praise to everyone that uh, posted feedback on the uh, forum post about the DFC collection, Danny, Freshell, Grief, Mitch, Nicola, Shuga, Lauren, and, and some others that I may be missing. I want to give praise, give praise to uh, Ahmad, Danny, Rodri, Lauren, who met with me uh, on, a, on a chat to discuss about the collection, Kotabe and Ashley for taking care of uh, Eve from Pluto platform when I was unavailable uh, last week and for all the design team for the amazing designs they've done for it Barcelona. And I'll pass it to Shuga. Thank you, Santi. Hi, everybody. I'm at the library, so I'm going to just pipe my praise, but I just wanted to praise Chewy because I haven't seen him in very long, and I'm super excited he's here, but I'm going to pass it, and I'm going to write my praise because I can't talk very loud. Freshel? No, I think Frischel already went, right, Frischel? Uh, uh, you okay. uh, let's, let's throw it to Lilith. Hello. Uh, I have praised to give. I have praised to give to Heather for staying with me for the whole process, uh, reaching out internally and making things possible. I have praised to give to Marco uh, for answering all my questions and being a really cool dude. Um, I have praised to give to Nico because he has been onboarding me and I ne never got back to him, but he's amazing. 
Um, I have praise to give to Ahmad because he was super quick in his response and helped me immediately, immediately a lot. Thank you so much. And I want to give praise to all the people working on the TE Academy with me because they seem super chill and I really look forward to working with them. Um, who I, I, I give it to Ava. Uh, who, who? Like the last one in the list, Ava? Ava? Oh, nice. Octopus Ava. Oh, Octopus Ava is server muted. Let me see if we can unmute her. Oh, yeah. Ava, are you there? No. Okay, that's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll I can, I can, let's just throw it to Moshe Hop. Hello everyone, thanks Griff. Um, I'm gonna praise uh, Heather for being such a great person with her check-in this week. I wanna praise Ahmad for finding uh, Jivan and growing uh, the team in Dubai. And I wanna praise Monique for uh, facilitating the Kubernetes presentation meeting. I wanna praise uh, Jim for uh, his uh, his uh, high hopes and uh, his uh, motivation during his COVID period. I want to praise Kai for being the best buddy that I can I could ever uh, ask for. I want to praise uh, Torai for his uh, effort and pitching in. Aside from having a busy schedule, I want to praise Cherik and Carlos for helping me test out my Kubernetes implementation. I want to praise Jivon uh, for joining. Oh, okay. <laughs> and all the dev team. And I think, uh, yeah, I'm done. I'll pass it on to uh, uh, Mitch. Wonderful, thank you. Um, I'd like to praise Griff for being the greatest Giveth cheerleader ever and shilling Giveth all over the world. Um, and Griff for also providing great advice on nice token utility, give economy research, or token swaps, and so much more. Uh, Ramin, Cherik, Mohammed, Ali, Reza, Carlos, Monique, and Matteo for their quick responsiveness while I've been testing on the DAP. Um, Santi for updating us on the Giveth PFP collection. Uh, Mert for translating the Giveth docs into Turkish. Uh, Katabi for advancing the DWORK integration. Chad Fai for stepping up and leading the Give Economy research team with great organization. Uh, for Shell for joining the multi-sig signers, Lauren for facilitating Give Economy development, Carlos for help on testing the segment events, uh, Mohammed, Mo, and Christopher for being quick and active um, for getting the nice token into development, and Amin for setting up the Give Farm extension transactions. And I'll have some more to dish, but yeah, okay. Let's see who we got here. Um. Michelangelo. Hello. Um, I praise Monique for um, the feedback that he gave for project categories. I praise Mo for uh, working with me for project categories and also being very um, active and quickly responding to me. Um, I praise Rodri for brainstorming with me for the NICE project. I praise Ken for completing, I praise and congratulate Ken for completing two weeks with us at Give It. Um, I also praise Mo again for bringing the design team closer this week. Nice, and it's getting down there. There are, there are not very many people to pass to, so I can, I can just pass for you and we can throw it to Nico. Hey guys. Thanks, Griff. Um, praise to Heather and Ahmad for the constant reminders and their valuable inputs in the HR processes. Praise to Lauren for having her buddy call with Todd and for him for her input for the on the feedback form. Praise to Mo Shihab for helping Jivan. Praise Jivan for joining the team. Praise to Santig, to Rive and Todd for filling out the self review forms. And praise to Frischel for always guiding me with all my questions. Thank you. And praise to Ashley for conducting a buddy review call with Melody. Passing it back to Griff. Thanks, Griff. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, let's throw it over to Logo Not. Good to see you, Logo. Oh, Logo Not. Not fast enough. Uh, unmute if, and I'll watch uh, for later. In the meantime, let's throw it over to uh, uh, Todd Y. 
Hey everyone, good to be here. Um, starting out with uh, praise to Nico and Frischel for the onboarding support and uh, the yeah period periodic review. Um, praise to Clara and Kotabe for the great discussion yesterday uh, during the member onboarding session. Uh, praise to Heather uh, for being proactive about um, uh, contributor review and, and support. And final praise goes to Griff, Lauren, and Yas for all of the hard work on the TLDR post uh, for the Angel Vault. And I will pass it to Kotabe. Have you gone? Nope. Thank you. Um, so praise to Todd and Clara for a great talk yesterday with Human Talk. Praise to Lauren to keep for keeping things organized. Praise Chad Fai uh, for the new um, structure for the give uh, call, research call. Uh, praise Jake for a great one-on-one -on -one call earlier this morning. Praise Nicola for uh, suggesting um, to add the AMA in some emails. Uh, praise Ashley for being a great working group steward. Uh, keeping Discord in order and pushing for a new Discord structure. Praise Mateo for bringing my head to ease after an attempt to be scammed. Um, praise Heather and Marco for involving in Iron Hack. Praise Mitch for the nice token, for the best thing proposals, and for just being an Excel magician. Uh, praise Ahmad for the referral work that he's doing. Uh, praise Amin for just keeping the farms working so well. Praise Santix for the PFP progress. Uh, and praise to many more of you. I'll keep ditching my praises. Um, so I don't know. Uh, let, yeah, Griff, can you pass it for me? For me? Definitely. Uh, let's throw it to Suena. So, so, Suna? I don't actually know how to say your handle. Hi. Um, can you hear me? Yeah. Hi. My name is Jerusha. Um, I'm pretty new on this whole space anyway, so, and I'm also driving, so I'm just going to say praise to the universal God that I'll get there safely, um, but I'll leave it to you guys, and I'll just be listening right now. Perfect, perfect. Well, then let's go <laughs> to Tustin. So, I'm praise and all for this welcome I'm and praise and you for I uh, work on project categorization and filter and uh, and praise everybody on the design team for being awesome teammates and praise Griff and Lauren for just overseeing everything and then uh, and praise Marco for his comment on the design with the various design tasks and then uh, that's all and I'll praise everybody for being a uh, and passing to Griff. I don't know what's on for. Yeah, now we just have the people who are sneaking in at the last minute. Let's throw it to Acid Laser. Good to see you here, Acid Laser. <laughs> Thank you, Griff. Uh, I'd praise Griff for his talk at Consensus. Uh, Lauren for all the great work she does at Twitter. It's amazing. Um, praise to Chewy because he told me that Bob Bergwins is going to be here, and that's why I'm here. Um, I'll pass it. I don't know. Maybe, uh, I don't know, Willie Fox. I no, I can pass it for you. It's too hard at this point. Yeah, uh, let's throw it to Amin. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I want to praise Moshe for uh, preparing a demo for Kubernetes. Uh, I uh, want to praise Monique for onboarding Q1. I want to praise uh, G1 uh, for uh, uh, being onboarded there fast and uh, yeah. Uh, we are lucky to have him. I want to praise uh, all the uh, Ramin, Cherik, Alirazam, and Mohammed for attending the gathering and then what we ran. I want to praise Mitch for verifying the monthly transaction I have prepared. I want to praise Lauren for setting up a uh, dev call for the gift power to facilitate uh, 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 deploying that faster. And yeah. Uh, I don't remember my uh, uh, my sure uh, praise at this moment, but I want to praise all of you. I thank you to you both to uh, pass down another word. Nice. I think we just have two more. Let's throw it over to Know How uh, ninety two. Uh, praise is crazy. Do you have anybody to praise uh, that you want to show gratitude to? 
I don't know how you just snuck in. I, I can save you the, I can save you. Sorry for calling on you like that. Um, but if you have any praise to give, feel free to unmute. But in the meantime, I'll throw it over to Marco, I think, to finish this off. Hey, hey, thanks, Griff. Uh, I'm actually on my phone, so can't pull up my praise sheet right now. So I'm just going to praise everybody who joined this call. Thank you, everybody. Praise to everyone, the whole team. And I pass it back to you, Griff. Great. Okay, then let's let's get this party started. Uh, let's, uh, I'll start sharing screen. Welcome to Community Call 118. Man, we've had a lot of these things. Uh, you guys just experienced praise. I love praise. It's it's uh, not. We always start our community calls out with praise because it's the decentralized way to do updates. Uh, everyone uh, through a lens of gratitude. But the thing is, praise. What's really cool about praise is they actually turn into governance tokens. So people who receive praise get a voice in our DAO, uh, but only if you type it out. So if you had praise that you really want people to be rewarded for, make sure to type it in any channel in Discord, exclamation mark praise, uh, and but soon that will be backslash praise. Uh, there'll probably be more discussion on that later. Uh, uh, big of The big announcements, uh, we have Lauren and Corey representing at MetaFest in, right after this call. So that's super cool. Thank you, praise you guys for do, for representing. Uh, we have round, we are round we're open for round 13, so don't forget to donate on Giveth to get that round 13 PO app, and of course to support your favorite projects. And big gathering in ETH Barcelona, July 6th to 8th. So uh, hopefully a lot of us will be out there, uh, and it'll be, for many of us, the first time any of us meet each other. So it'll be super cool. Uh, it, definitely reach out to Jesse if you need any assistance on organizing there. Also, uh, to stay flat, we uh, we don't have managers, but we do have uh, reviews and feedbacks with our buddy calls. So if you have anybody that you think is doing really well, or maybe they need some improvement, don't be shy. Fill out this contributor uh, type form. I know you would love it if someone gave you feedback, right? So the more feedback we can give each other, the better we can be as a team. And if you really want to improve your buddy review calls, uh, don't be shy about filling out this self-review. Uh, it, it's a good guide for just having a great way to get better uh, and have a great buddy review call. Uh, yeah, and then let's just jump into the working group section and uh, dive into the community circle. And I'm just going to zoom through over to Lauren so we can save some time so Bob has more time to speak. Uh, yeah. So Lauren, you want to take it away? Yeah, comms working group updates. You can go to the next slide, Griff. So Griff was, as we mentioned, in Austin. Uh, and Willie was there too, actually, the, this past week. And he gave an awesome version of the 10.5 trillion Web3 opportunity talk uh, with a really punchy caption, a uh, punchy ending slogan the future of giving is investing so i can't wait for the recording of that to come out he totally killed it um eve barcelona uh we've got an awesome swag order in so if you take a look at the comm slide we've got these like really cool stickers coming we've got the swag logo the rocket ship the church it's all gonna be really exciting so if you can come to eve barcelona um definitely come because you'll not only have a great time you'll also get hooked with swag the cult eth region farm is live and rewards are pumping so that's the the tweet about that so just check it out if you haven't already also gitcoin grant round 14 is still live we have two active grants give us io and give us trace so if you love give us and you love what we're doing every small donation counts um also of of note the eth denver between two keys a fern between two keys special uh came out it's a satirical interview with griff about give us which is actually like really great at explaining giveth and also really funny and they basically make fun of each other the whole time so if you haven't checked it out please check it out also last week i was on a twitter space with doing good that was on spanish and uh had a great opportunity to talk about giveth there so if you haven't checked it out there's the recording coming up today as mentioned we've got the women in web 3 panel which is right after this call in the metafest 2 discord channel um it's linked in the first slide uh and corey and i will both be there and then a little bit after that i'm going to be giving a talk called where giving gives back and it's going to be all about giveth it's going to be about giveth about give backs how to use your give why have given the first place where is this going and i'm really excited about it so check it out if you can um also coming soon we're going to be getting these featured project tweet threads coming up on a regular basis and in the interest of time that is all i have for comps and I'm passing it to, uh, um, um, I don't know, Communitas? Connect. Me. Ashley. Me. Okay, I just have a couple updates this week. We're back, and the first one is that we're having a Discord, Discord overall. It's ha uh, overhaul. It's happening this weekend. Oh, I can't talk. 
So um, if you find yourself not being able to answer or to access any of the channels that you used to be able to, just reach out to me or Giantkin um, once those changes. And if you want to give feedback, there's a forum post here um, with a link to the test Discord, and you can check it out. There's a couple questions, especially if you're a working group steward. Please take a look and, and leave feedback on your respective categories. And the next thing, let's see. Um, we have our weekly community AMA and orientation call. So if you're a new contributor, someone interested in starting to contribute, a project owner that has questions about your project, or a donor who wants to know more about Give, you can come to this call and we can help you um, figure out some of those answers. Also, we're looking for more active community builders, and there's a link there to see what the tasks would be to become one of those. So let me know if you're interested, and then I think it goes to Connect next. Hi. Hi, everyone. Um, the goal of the Connect group is to connect Web3 public goods, the general public goods sectors, and address biases, misinformation, and the learning curves. And if you can go to the next slide, please. Um, main updates this week. Um, our current focus has been on attracting new projects to the platform. This week, Melody and Rhino went to an EU consult event. Um, the main takeaways from that were that there were some political activist groups who can't get nonprofit status, and it could be interesting to onboard them to give us and kind of fitted in with some of the discussions that we've been having around these niche groups being ideal, ideally suited for our platform. Um, there is a project ranking forum post that Reiner put out early in the week. Um, his suggested ranking factors, some of them are the verification status, um, popularity among gift holders, number of donations, um, likes from users, social impact activity, and freshness, amongst other things. And the... Um, Upcoming forum post, there is one coming from Melody and Kotabe, who they have identified Propel as great partner for crypto education. There's an upcoming um, donor survey with Jake and Melody. And just a reminder that the next strategy workshop on impact is on the 28th of June. And there's an upcoming forum proposal on contributor rewards, which Melody has posted. Thank you for showing that. And I, who's next? Who do I pass it to? Builders, that's Kotabe. Over to you. I'm muted. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thanks, thanks. Uh, the, the, the mute button was stickier than usually. <laughs> Um, so uh, what's been up here with the Builders update? Well, um, the Iron Hack um, kind of partnership is uh, moving a bit forward. It's, it's back in the cooker. There are DMs with uh, Hanier and Markov right now. So we'll see what's the best way to, to really take on advantage of this opportunity. Um, and it's with the people that it should be now. So what else about the work? Um, we had some tests last week. Uh, they are, I'm, like, I'm in, in a few calls with um, the team from Aragorn, and I also want to get into a call with, with the team of Shapeshift, which seems to be um, using like great D work, having a great implementation of D work. Actually, people of D work recommended like the, as best practices what Shapeshift is doing for that. So um, I'll keep collecting some best practices, and I hope to have a, a, a pilot uh, ready maybe next week. Um, and then with Clutiview, we are still talking about uh, what's, what's the best way to collaborate, and um, we're considering maybe uh, pilot this with uh, Give It First uh, before offering to kind of like any projects, and uh, maybe launching something or, or do something at ETH Barcelona uh, or maybe uh, next call. We'll see. Uh, so yeah, those are the builder updates. Thank you. And I'll pass it to Amin, I guess. Yeah, thank you. Uh, 
yeah, our update is uh, we mostly change the we were we were mostly work on the uh, implementing the uh, project verification flow. So everyone who wants to verify its project can uh, uh, do it from to our front end, and not the use the type form. Uh, and the UI we have implemented almost all of that. Uh, it's responsiveness. Uh, it supports the uh, mobile view, and uh, now it is integrated with backend. Just few uh, points are remain. Uh, the social authentication. Social. Uh, you can connect your pro, uh, your project to the uh, social networks, uh, for instance, LinkedIn, Twitter, or, uh, or others, or verify your emails. Some kind of uh, some details like this are under the test, and we are working on this. To uh, we hope that we uh, have a demo on next Monday. Uh, also, we are working on implementing the multi recipient. Uh, address uh, for every project, so uh, every project owner will have the uh, will be enable. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, and it enables every project owner to have different address per network, one for mainnet, one for XI, or any, or any other network that we 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 will support in the future. Uh, and the give economy, the give farm uh, reward uh, is ready to go. So uh, our current give farm program will uh, will be fin uh, will be uh, uh, finished in seven days almost. So after that, the new rounds of farming uh, our uh, rewards are paid for farming uh, and give farm. Uh, we have implemented for give power. We have implemented its front end, uh, general page, and uh, the smart contracts uh, the, uh, implementation. I uh, had some progress. Uh, hopefully, we have a co uh, productive call with Sam. And yeah, and that's it. And, and our, pro our uh, plan in, in our plan, the notification center is uh, the next priority. It's under design. Uh, design guys are working on this. Uh, we have, uh, we are working on improving the sorting, categorizing the projects and fulfilling them in the UI. Uh, we, uh, we are working on completing our, our uh, API uh, service, Epic Air, and uh, multi-level accounts in our next uh, priority. Uh, yeah, and the, uh, the biggest news and platform is that we have hired a new delivery manager, uh, a special talent. We are happy to have him. G1 has joined us recently, and you will help us. And we were too lucky. <laughs> we are so lucky to have him. Uh, I want to welcome him here again. And yeah, that's it. I pass it back to you. To me, to me, mm, I'll yes. take it. I'll take it. Oh uh, yeah, Laura. Yeah, Laura. Yes. Pass to Laura. Thanks, Amin. Um, so Give Economy Working Group, uh, you can hit the next slide. Um, bunch of exciting stuff happening Give Economy Working Group. First, public service announcement. If you're having trouble connecting to Gnosis Chain, you may need to update your RPC endpoint. So that's right here. There's a link to our tweet there about it, which also links to the Gnosis Chain doc tweet, which links to the documentation. So all easy peasy from there. You just need to kind of like basically update um, a URL. Uh, on the development side, as I mentioned, the call at ETH Regen Farm is live and rewards are flowing. Everything's looking really good over there. We've got a new uh, Give Power prototype. We're, we're working on finalizing the design for that. And um, as Amin mentioned, the contracts are coming along as well. Um, extending the Give Farm, multi stick transactions. He mentioned that too. Nice token. We've got an epic coming up for Nice Token, so we're going to be starting to develop all of the little elements to get the Nice Token to incentivize um, stablecoin donations to the Giveth uh, project. Region Farms outreach is also ongoing on the Giveth Give Economy re research side of things. There's been some updates on the Angel Vault process. We're actually not going to be using a Regen pool at all, and we're not going to be pushing pushing Fay anymore. We're just going to be uh, setting up the Angel Vault with Dai. And the summary forum post is really really close to being finished now. So hopefully it gets posted sometime this week and get the full lowdown of what that will look like and vote. Token swaps. Token swaps are happening. We've posted forum posts in Prime and House. Uh, we're talking. We're drafting forum posts for GTC and Honey, and we're chatting with DLD 
Pan, Balancer, and Ichi. Um, nice Token discussion is still ongoing in the forum, so if you want to talk about some of the utility of Nice Token, please jump in there. And Uma Success Token, we actually didn't get to touch on that in the research call, but it is still there as a, as a concept that we are discussing to try to uh, protect Gibbous in the chilly, chilly bear market. That is all I have for Give Economy. I'm going to pass it to Mo for design. Hi, hi everybody. So for design updating design updates today. So now give power, give power, give power. So we are currently improving and simplifying the ways users can actually stake and work together give power. And then we have a prototype link. So you can actually follow that and check out what we are doing. And the work is still ongoing on project categories and filtering and then you sorting your project according to either types, project sectors, and then from the newest to the oldest, most liked and then most funded project, interesting stuff. And then we are start to work on notification center to actually show users all the notifications they received an overview. So you can actually review and see all your activities you've performed on the platform. If you're on the farm, you're donating to a project, or you are requesting and waiting project verification as a project owner, or you like a project and you're supporting a project in any other way, the overview will be available for you while on the, in the notification center. And then we the nice token, like uh, Lauren said, working on nice token. So basically, once if you donate with XDAI or DAI tokens, you are eligible to to get nice to, to get nice tokens as a form of give backs so basically you you donate to text die or you donate to your die stable coins you get into to a ratio of one to one you get an uh, equivalent amount of nice token so and then we're also working on a pop poap design for your nice token and then we're adding banners and then updating the flow to let users actually interact with nice token as a form of give backs so that's all for design and then back to give yeah that mute button is sticky today thank you so much Tassani. and uh yeah let's just dive in so vacation lots of people taking vacation coming up it's summertime so pablo's uh taking today and tomorrow off katabe is off on monday's three-day weekends nice work katabe uh, i'm actually going to be off on monday too uh and and then be halftime june 23rd to the 30th uh, uh giant kin is off on the 21st spend some dad time uh lauren's gonna be traveling on the 23rd and 24th todd is off at the end of the at the end of this month next week basically ahmad is taking two weeks off well deserved and moshe hob is taking a few days off as well at the end of the month uh make sure to leave these guys alone let them enjoy their vacation unless it's an emergency course uh but uh it's we gotta honor we gotta celebrate people taking vacation it's hard to do in web3 sometimes <laughs> Uh, and as far as updates on the governance side, buddy review calls, don't forget to call your buddies. Uh, there's a bunch of really cool forum posts up there. I'm just going to really quickly say HR upgrade is still in full swing. I saw Ramin made a role proposal up there, and there's a few other role proposals that are worth reading uh, and haven't gone to vote yet. So definitely check out those role proposals. Uh, Q2022 vesting is still uh, up there. Uh, Connect and comms, are they, are they merging their working group calls? I don't think so, but we'll, that, that conversation is still, in, is still up there. Nice tokens. We got NF, some NFTs, initial sketches. Those are really good. Check them out. Uh, and we also have some bureaucratic stuff that give us swag and servers reimbursement posts are up. Thank you for Shell. And of course, we are hiring. So uh, we got to welcome a few new people this month. Nico, Mio, Jake, Corey, and Javon just this week. Uh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, if you guys see these the, these new contributors around, and I think there might even be a couple more, uh, don't be shy. Uh, say hello and welcome them to the team. I'll also, we're still looking for, uh, actually, I don't know if we're looking for a lead QA tester anymore. Uh, I'll have to get an update on that. But senior Solidity developer, we're always looking for, uh, definitely still looking for UI designers and always need delivery managers, people who can deliver and people who like writing form posts for other DAOs. Uh, so with that, I'll throw it over to Mitch for the DAO group. Thanks, Griff. 
Um, so yeah, we have our governance calls on Mondays at 10 a.m. Um, Eastern, 4 p.m. Central European time. And so let's just look through the DAOs here. We have four different DAOs that we use to um, keep our governance decentralized. We have Gardens, Aragon, we have Nosa Safe, we got Snapshots. What do you want? We got them all. Um, some updates, deadline for role proposals to pass um, will be the July 5th. So if you um, have a work agreement with Giveth, get your role proposal up on the DAO and pass by July 5th. Um, in the NRGiv DAO, we've got two active proposals, um, server cost reimbursement and swag cost reimbursement. In the Give Garden, the sponsor ETH Barcelona top up, and also the Entrando al Espacio Crypto, the retroactive sponsorship for that as well. Um, in the multi SIGs, we have a transaction to update one of the signers from Hannah to Fischel, and that is up in all four multi SIGs. And also the transactions to extend the Give Farm on Mainnet and Gnosis Chain. So the links are all in there. Um, I will mention the Give Farm extension on Mainnet. Amin had to do some fixes, and so it might be a little bit confusing. But if you have any questions, just please ask me. And in Snapshot, nothing for now. So that's it for the multi-sigs, and I'll pass it back to Griff. Yeah, wow, thank you. And, you know, maybe, uh, yeah, well, I guess it, I think Bob Burnquist really is pretty easy to introduce. Honestly, it's, it's crazy. I was playing him. I was playing his character on Tony Hawk back in the day. I, I can't believe that we're on a video call. That's so cool. Uh, and, and major praise goes to Willie for bringing him in. Uh, and, and I'm excited to hear about, uh, what you have for us, Bob. So if you want, you can just take it away. Sweet. Well, this is awesome, you guys. Thank you so much. Um, I've just been listening in here, getting deep tech dive on everything that's going on, and, and it's incredible to see a platform like this happening and this this crew, you know, making uh, moves in this way. Um, you know, I, I've gotten into uh, crypto something like. 2016, maybe 17, more on like, hey, you know, buy some Bitcoin, sell some Bitcoin, make some money. You know, they had no idea really how deep and what the technology technology was about. And as time went by, obviously, uh, got got wind of the whole DeFi summer thing. NFT was kind of going, okay, this is this is incredible. Let me try and jump in somehow. So initially, uh, you know, most people were like, hey, you can make a bunch of money you know, selling an NFT, you know, you do art, da, da, da. And I was like, well, is it, is it about making a bunch of money or is it about uh, connecting, you know, to a community in a different way, my fan base and all that. So it's kind of like at the same time as that, all that's happening, the way, because I'm from Brazil, I guess the way I think uh, is always to try and bring value to the people around me and who's with me and how to help you know, a bunch of different uh, people and bring them into to uh, learning what's going on. And so uh, when I landed on Tezos, it was it was mainly so that I can, you know, get to my crew on a low side, you know, like putting an NFT out for a few bucks, getting people to, you know, maybe do giveaways, feel involved, feel a part of something and then grow um, uh, the community that way, you know, and the reason I kind of went for this Burnquist gold thing, uh, you know, you see the flower of life and the, and the, uh, the golden ratio is that, you know, because building, building the reasoning and telling people why I did this kind of, you know, some info, you know, of life it obviously and yeah, you learn about the you know the uh, uh sacred geometry and and just there's messaging behind it and then and there's a connection of i mean skateboarding to me is very uh every trick i land to me is is a praise I and mean, i see we just did this whole praise thing and I, this is really, really cool because that's kind of how i feel when i land a trick is it's pretty spiritual and pretty intimate you know it's a manifestation so um kind of that's how i see when i landed the brinkwist gold put this whole uh, 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 idea behind community and bringing value to you and bringing value to who is involved is why I landed on on Tezos and it was it was one of the coolest things just because it was a great community I, I landed on uh, Hicket Nunk you know the OG and and it was uh, it was a great community they just welcomed in and and um, it just felt good that it, that that it wasn't about you know the making a bunch of money you know selling one 
piece of art and then that's it you know there's there's a message there's a connection there's a reason and then there's actually a community i want to reach which is uh the brazilian community and the people that that um are my fans and there's fans all, all around the world but without spending a bunch of money to be involved without feeling like hey i you know you got to be rich to be bob's fan type of thing you know so once that happened, I did this little, uh, you know, I'll go into the Institute, but we have these events uh, with the Brazilian Art um, uh, uh, Foundation, which is a government um, uh, institution, with the University of Rio de Janeiro, which is also a government institution. So I've done a lot of projects with big institutions, you know, um, to be, that was about, uh skateboarding art uh music um education right it was this whole fun cultural type event and i just kind of threw out there hey whoever has burnquist gold can show up and i'll just throw vip and we can hang out you know i didn't i didn't know who was going to show up but we had five kids show up and these guys you know were artists and they were artists from local favelas like local communities so they were actually uh, kids that you know don't make a bunch of money live in really hard conditions and were exploring web3 and they landed a burnquist gold and here i am talking to them and then once that happened i realized i did the right thing at the right protocol for the right reason and connected with the people i wanted to connect so that gave me kind of a click on okay my institute needs to gear towards tech because I know that blockchain could really, I feel like it's social, you know, in its natural state, you know, just because it's connecting people. But when, when these, these kids from the community uh, showed up, I was like, okay, I have to gear the institute towards tech. I have to, if I want to help Brazil out, I need to get these kids to learn technology, uh, learn about Web3, learn about NFTs, and then they can go to their communities and maybe uh, 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 help their friends getting into it. And it, it really uh, will change their lives. A lot of these kids are, are, are already like making a lot more money that they, than they ever had, you know, just kind of connecting with people around, you know, around the world. So once I kind of, you know, that Eureka moment uh, happened, it was all about, okay, I need to educate, you know, and we start a program called Crypto Kids or Crypto Kriya, we call. And and anyone that is not into crypto is a Crypto Kriya. You, ha- you, can, you can be 70 years old or you can be 10 or 15, you know, uh, if you're just coming in, we just want to kind of give you the the basics, right? Just kind of help out, show you certain things you can do, how to use, uh, you know, because skateboarding, obviously we film a lot, we do a lot of content, you know, so I want to teach them how to like use content, not in a way where someone else is making the money, um, but in the way that you can bring value to what you're doing. So maybe content on the blockchain, okay, so maybe watching an NFT or looking at the new ways, new social media, or even um, coming the, up with solutions that your community room. might need. And, you know, and I as I was uh, gonna, going uh, through that, go I earlier, connected with I will, these guys um, at Project Impact. Uh, and what they do is they, t- they take there, technology to the favelas. Like they help out these kids at inside the favelas, uh, inside the community. So then they learn the blockchain or they learn the program just in general. So if they're making a little bit of money, you know, a month, once they go through the program, they triple that. So, and they really change uh, right. their lives. Sure and to, what happens, have other now they do these hackathons Discord to come up with solutions uh, like on Web3 for their community. So there's so much that I felt like Is this I, gearing... It's more, I mean, people, yes, people, we need food, we need to eat. Um, yeah, Puff, I think you can go uh, ahead and pass all the that, people that are prepped to into the main room right now, and then we'll okay. just um, check more and Because uh, I'm not from okay. the favela. Okay. Well, like, I, well, I, I know too. a lot of people, and yeah. I hang out uh, there. Lawrence, I, stay know, here we, for a bit. We do a lot of work, but I, I don't really uh, live that, if you can that see problem. So we need people that are from there to come up with those solutions and connect with their peeps and really engage. So the institute just no kind of took a, a whole nother and route. Whole of, you know, during the, the pandemic, the we room. did the, mm-hmm. you know, the masks, the EPI. I was just saying what it does is it removes 